can't even say it's top of the morning for me because I've been up already and I had the remote call with first things first, knock that out. Now the grind of my day starts and I'm headed to train. This is what I do, 9 a.m. training session. Last about an hour and 45 minutes, look, maybe two hours. And that's really only because it's three of us that train together, so it takes time. But um, if I were training by myself, it would take me about an hour, hour 15 minutes, knock it out, be in and out, on to the next thing. But training, upper body day, training for my men's physique competition that is at the end of next month, June 27th, first time headed on stage i'm excited body transformation has been pretty phenomenal i can't even lie man i'm i'm excited about the results that i've been getting looking forward to continuing to uh sustain the gains that i've acquired due to my uh shredding now and that's a caloric surplus for me or i shouldn't say no, not a caloric surplus a cal caloric deficit that I'm in now which just it taps your boy a little more energy spent workouts are more challenging every single day but I got it in me let's go get it Jacked and lean gym, where the strong get stronger, where the jacked get jacked, where the lean get even leaner, baby. That's what we doing. We working, gotta get it. sauna for about 15 20 minutes longest I'll go is about 20 maybe 23 minutes or so um, and depending on the day if it's upper body I'm not as fatigued although today was upper body and I'm, I'm pretty drained I try to read I got I got my Bible commentary in here in my uh my bible and i'll typically read and then i got this my wife is constantly getting me books this book is called influencer building your personal brand in the age of social media <laughs> talking about perfect timing for a book everybody's trying to rebrand and pivot their businesses so we all need that information within those those books. Um, and then some days, to be honest, I will fall asleep. Not fall asleep to where I'm completely sound asleep, but you know, more of a doze because I have to be conscious of the fact that I am in the sauna 
and I don't want to overheat and dehydrate completely, which is why this comes with me everywhere. My Yeti 64 ounce bottle. You, this is my handy dandy. If I was Dora the Explorer, it's like my my backpack, backpack, wherever Dora is or backpack is, wherever I am, you typically can find me by way of the the Yeti bottle. I'm gonna get this phone up out of here though. Because what I don't want is for my phone to overheat. Because that will happen. That has happened to me in the past. I typically don't bring my phone in here, but because of you, you got the exclusive inside the sauna with your boy. But now you gotta go. So after this, this Greg's gotta eat. Gotta eat. Can you see it? I'm starting to get a little drained. Workouts are starting to really jump on me a little bit because of my my low calorie intake down to 2200 calories and i'm feeling it i'm not gonna lie i'm feeling it but what i won't do is allow it to be become an excuse um, for me to not give the output that i know i can give it may not match what i once was giving you know, the numbers and the low may not be the same, but as far as how I work, how I grind, that won't change. I'm always give a hundred. That's all I know to do. Appreciate you guys hanging with me. This journey has been cool. And it will continue. I'll add you. Thank you.